Now I'm going to go over um, the two sound series with you. And we're going to start with ball change. I'm going to do it from this side. Just like we know that a ball is the, the ball tap, is the, the, the one right here in front, the ball tap. We're going to go on the ball of the foot. And then we're going to step with the other foot or stamp. I, I usually stamp. Ball, stamp. Ball, stamp. You go in front most of the time uh, with, the, with the stamp and the ball is to the back most of the time. But there is, you can do it in different places. You will see it in front sometimes. Ball change. Okay. Um, see, then uh, we sometimes combine that. I'm just going to jump ahead a little to this shuffle. So when you brush forward, brush back, knee up that I showed you a minute ago, that is a two sound step. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you see that my heel does not go beyond this cap. I mean, this leg. Okay. So that's shuffle. Well, I can combine the uh, ball change, which is a two sound step, with the shuffle, which is a two sound step, and uh, I can get something that's kind of fun to hear. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Try it on the other foot. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Shuffle, ball change. Okay, we also have flaps. Flaps can be um, can be running or they can be stationary. I'm going to show you the running flap. We're going to brush with a ball tap. And we're going to leap onto that leg, which is our right foot. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Come hard on this floor. It's a little bit small. That is a running flap. It's a little faster. What you have to be careful when you do your running flaps is you don't start butting them up and only get one sound. People tend to do that. You want to hear two sounds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? So sometimes we will combine a, a flap with a ball change. So we can do a, a lap, ball change. Let's try that again. Good. And you notice I'm on my ball taps when I do that. Now you can do a stationary flap. Let me go over again the difference between the shuffle and the flap. So when I do a shuffle, I end up on the same foot every time. Unless I put my foot down and do the other foot. One, two, and one, and two, and three, and four. I'm staying on the same foot. But when you do a flap, you're changing feet. You're always changing feet. When you do a stationary flap, you're not going anywhere. It's hard to do that one slow. Let me do it so you can see from the front what it looks like. Show you from the back. your own speed, but the faster you go, the easier it is to hold your balance on that one. Okay, um, pull backs. 
So this is another two, in the two sound series, two sound step. We lift our toe up, we snap our foot, step back, and the next toe comes up. Keep that heel on the floor. Do not pick that up. Back, step, toe up. Pull back, step, toe up. Pull back, step, toe up. Pull back. Do that one again. That's a really important step. We use that a lot. flexing my feet. Okay, so that is the pull back. The last one is called the scuffle, and I haven't used that in a dance yet, but you step it, and then you brush back with the ball tap. Step with the heel, brush back with the ball tap. Scuff, now brush back. being out like this. You can't see it because you can just see the bottom. Okay, that's the review of the one and two sound steps. And uh, I'll have another lesson for you shortly.